So I want to go ahead and make a quick video saluting and uh, clapping for a man named Mark Robinson. Uh, Mark Robinson, if you haven't heard the name, is a Christian Republican serving as Lieutenant Governor of North Carolina. Uh, he's also the first African-American man to hold the office in that state. He's also a Christian. And right now he's in deep water. He's in deep trouble with the LGBTQ community for simply seeking to have all sexually explicit LGBTQ themed books removed from North Carolina schools. Right now we have students, children from the second, third, fourth and fifth grades reading about transgenderism which is sexually explicit material. You cannot separate sexuality from the notion of a man attempting to take on the likeness of a woman. And he's seeking to have those books removed. Um, and we know what comes with that. So we need to pray for this man as he seeks to fight against a bunch of people who are suffering from a reprobate mind. In Romans 1.28, we see, and since they did not see fit to acknowledge God, God gave them up to a debased mind to do what not ought to be done. The word debased means a reduced or a reduced in quality or valued mind. And so essentially it's a mind that doesn't even function. And so right now he's making waves all over YouTube because of cancel culture. They're attempting to cancel him. And that's expected. Uh, it's also expected that the heat's going to continue to rise and the persecution is going to get worse. So pray for this man. I'm going to go ahead and play a a small clip of one of his recent uh, speakings at a local church. We have reached a point in public schools now where first off, we're telling our children, uh, don't be so sure you're a little girl or a little boy. There's no reason anybody anywhere in America should be telling any child about transgenderism, homosexuality, any of that filth. And yes, I called it filth. And if you don't like it, then I call it filth. Come see me and I'll explain it.